After convincing homecoming win, Sam Houston heads to Beaumont to face Southland opponent the Lamar Cardinals. Sticking with the 1-0 mindset, the Cats know this is not a game they can overlook. Each, each week you got to go ahead and start over again and, and you can't carry over uh, you know, a loss or a victory you know, each week. So we, we go ahead and review the game that we just got done playing on Monday and then we, you know, I tell them we flush out one down the toilet and we get ready for the next ball game. And, and so all our focus and energy is on Lamar. Like after the game last year, they were saying, don't worry about it, we'll be back next year, we'll be back next year. And it, and it shows that, that their offense is way better than they was last year. I can tell it's, it's not going to be that easy as it was last year. I mean, when we turn on the film, they, it's, it's obvious that they play real hard. You know, they, don't, uh, they bring a lot of pressure. They're, uh, they're, they're very disciplined. So um, I'm pretty sure that, that they're going to have um, – that obviously myself to stop the run, so they're probably going to stack the box and to bring a lot of pressure. So, so we just got to outblock them and outplay them. The Cardinals rely heavily on their running game, but with a young quarterback, the Bearcats plan to force him into passing situations. We like those teams that, that do run the football. We feel like we really have got a great run defense, and that's what we pride ourselves in defensively. So we'll do the same formula that we do every week. We're going to recruit a lot of guys towards the line of scrimmage and, and try to outpopulate them in between the tackles and, and make it as difficult as we can to, for them to be successful running it and hopefully uh, uh, create a one-dimensional team where they have, to, they have to throw the ball every down. Uh, off the film, he's, I think he's a pretty mobile quarterback. He made good decisions. He don't like, just throw the ball up. He made good decisions. and. He gonna get the ball thrown, and uh, our D line gotta maintain him, and our DBs have to lock up the receivers, cause if the receivers get open, he will make the throws to get them there. But I think if we blitz him, like like you said, he don't have that much experience back there. He hasn't been playing. I think if we blitz him, we'll scam a little bit, and we should be all right. The Cats look for their fifth consecutive win as they head to Beaumont this Saturday. The game kicks off at 3 p.m. and will be televised by Southland TV. For the Bearcat Sports Network, I'm Lainey Fritz.